Hello, Divine Feminines, and welcome back to my channel, Lumen Moon Tarot. So, Divine Feminine, I had to restart your video. I'm so sorry. Something, like, went wonky there. Um, but we didn't get that far in, okay? So, um, just take what resonates, leave the rest behind, right? And thank you so much, everyone, for all the love you guys give me every day. Thank you for the comments. Um, they're awesome. You guys make me laugh. You make me cry. Okay. Um, thank you to all of my subscribers. Welcome to everybody new here. All right. So Divine Feminine, I'm seeing that you're being absolutely silent when it comes to this person from your past. I feel like you're masculine. They want to talk. And they, they thought that you would chase after them. They thought that you would communicate with them first. If they waited out waited this out long enough like you would um you would break down right and you would call them or text them and that's not happening okay as a matter of fact i'm kind of getting the sense that you you don't want to talk to this person you may even be like trying to ignore some communication or avoiding right communication you've already made a decision here when it comes to this person you're not talking to them i feel like this person has wronged you okay and you're not playing any games if they did something wrong to you they need to step forward and they need to apologize and they need to have the kind of integrity um, that they need to do the right thing okay this person, I feel like they were playing a game with you of how long can I wait out the divine feminine, right? Well, they're going to they're gonna be waiting for a long time, okay? They probably shouldn't hold their breath because I'm telling you, you're not talking to them. You're actually moving on here um, with the world card. Uh, you're closing out a cycle. You've learned your lessons from this person. You've made a decision here. You don't want them back in your life. You're doing really well without them. Okay, you're being exalted too from any pains in the past. I'm feeling a, like a huge shift off of this card. Um, spirit is bringing you to a whole new level. Like they're putting you in the spotlight somehow. You could have your own... Um, I don't know, a channel or a website on the internet where people around the world are now watching you and, and um, hearing the messages and seeing whatever you're doing. It doesn't matter what you're doing, okay? Um, you're raising vibrations. You're inspiring other people. You're showing other people what the divine can do in your life. I feel like you are a walking testament of how spirit can lift you up from heartache, betrayal, difficult times and struggles, okay? You're a walking testament of what spirit can do if you allow them to lead you and guide you. I feel like that's what you've done here. You, you're very faithful. This, this cup that you hold in your hand, it's not just love in that cup, it's your faith, it's your intuition, it's your spiritual beliefs. It's, it's everything you believe in at a soul level is in that cup. And I feel like you've done nothing but walk in faith, um, letting the divine just take you through this healing process, right? And so now the divine has put you on a pedestal. They're exalting you, okay? And it's a time of celebration. Like you could be maybe making a huge accomplishment reaching a huge goal, um, receiving a big blessing that you've always wanted. Um, this is like a big change in your life. This is um, an upgrade, okay? This is you graduating from the last cycle as well, learning all your lessons, passing all your tests, passing through judgment. Yeah, so spirit is blessing you like in front of this person who's wronged you, okay? Like, it's clear for them to see. Um, they're able to see you. I feel like you're doing something on the Internet. You have some kind of platform, some kind of possible public status, okay? You could, be, you could have a lot of supporters. You could have 
a lot of fans. You could have um, just a lot of people who you're attracting attention from, you know, a lot of people love what you're doing, you know, yeah, and I feel like you, you're having this big victory, this feels like a glow up, like a major glow up, a major accomplishment, a time of celebration, um, also, I'm feeling this very luxurious energy off of you, Divine Feminine, so like, you're doing some beautiful things for yourself. Like um, some of you could be getting a massage or a beauty treatment or maybe getting a new dress or um, buying yourself a new fancy car or you could even be upgrading to a new home. There's something very luxurious about your energy right now, okay? Very luxurious, very beautiful, very standout um above like i uh, stand out uh, out of a crowd of people like people are noticing you a lot i'm hearing the song autograph by i think it's def leppard um so you could have some kind of stardom here people could start recognizing you yeah recognition thank you you're getting a lot of recognition <laughs> Uh, yeah, this is the, they're helping me through this reading. You're getting a lot of recognition for what it is that you're doing, okay? And this person knows it. I feel like it's um it's kind of making them feel heartbroken, okay? Heartbroken, maybe feeling threatened um because you're doing so well, they may feel inadequate next to you and your energy. Okay, and your success, because you're having a huge success here. So this person is like having um, like a roller coaster of emotions right now. Okay, I feel like a part of them is really proud of you and happy for you and excited about what you're doing. But a part of them is really sad, broken hearted and depressed. Um, because you don't want to talk to them anymore because you're not talking. Now this person, I, I feel like they're, yeah, they're afraid to approach. It's taken them too long to come in. Thank you, spirit. <laughs> this was on the bottom of the deck. The Knight of Pentacles is the slowest moving knight in the deck, and it's taken this person too long to come in and make things right. They've played this game for you uh, with you for too long, okay? Um, of like sitting back and waiting for you to chase after them. That is not going to happen. Especially since you're in Empress energy. The Empress never chases. You know your value. You know your worth. And you know that this person has wronged you and owes you an apology. You're not going to be starting any kind of conversation with them. I feel like you're moving on. You're like if this person doesn't stop playing their game if they can't stop playing games if they can't get the confidence um and the strength to come towards me and apologize and do the right thing then i'm out says divine feminine i'm out of here you get in your fancy car you know your chariot and you just keep moving forward um, some of you could even be making a house move a location change upgrading definitely you're going to start seeing a lot of upgrades happening in your life now. Okay? You are, because you're starting a new cycle. You know, I feel like this person, um, you could be dealing with a uh, Libra, Gemini, Aquarius. Very egotistical here. This is somebody who is all up in their ego. Maybe they treated you like you were, like they were better than you. Or they treated you like... Uh, like they had more than you or you didn't have enough like for sure they thought for sure you're gonna chase after them oh yeah you're definitely gonna break down and talk to them no that's not happening it's just not happening okay if somebody wronged you divine feminine they've got to come to you right and spirit is telling them that here with the higher font that's what Spirit's telling them. This person could have even at one point thought that they were larger than God. 
I feel like spirit is bringing this person down to size. They're knocking them down a bit. Okay, teaching them a lesson for sure. Okay, and I feel like this, you could have been their destiny. You're uh, in, definitely in this earth angel energy, okay? You are an earth angel, divine feminine. You're a light worker, a chosen one, a divine being, okay? And I feel like now spirit is moving you forward very quickly. I'm feeling this boomerang effect here. Um, it's, it's like everything is starting to gain momentum for you. You're going to start seeing a lot of upgrades happening for you, okay? And you're manifesting a new soulmate connection, too, coming in. You're going to start seeing a lot of opportunities opening up. When this Wheel of Fortune turns in your favor, it's like all these little doors open up for you, okay? New paths to choose, new options to choose from, new opportunities that will fall into your lap. Okay, choices. You'll actually have choices in life. And a lot of these choices, most of them will pro probably be pretty decent. So it's like, you know, and this person is over here uh, all upset, all upset because you're not chasing them. You're not giving in. You're not backing down. Okay, you've got a really strong stance here. You're moving on. I feel like, you know, you probably don't even think about this person as much as you did before. Like, for real. Um, I feel like you're very busy. You're very successful. And you're maintaining that. Okay, so you may work a lot, Divine Feminine. Okay, which is why you do need to be treating yourself to some things right now. Um, relaxing, rejuvenating. Okay, okay treating yourself really well because you had to work really hard to get to this point okay you just make it look easy <laughs> yeah you make it you, you, I feel like you did you made it look easy and this person is like um, angry furious jealous okay and spirit is stopping this person from coming towards you yeah, because of this, see, the divine knows this person, um, now they're going to want to take advantage of your success. They're going to want to take advantage of the money that you're making, all of your hard work, all of your opportunities. This person wants what you have now. And spirit can see it. So spirit's not letting this person come near you anymore. Okay, the door is shut. This is like a big, giant, metal, heavy vault door that's being slammed shut. This is the end to a cycle here and a new one beginning for you. And this person from your past, they need to hang back and learn their lessons because they were playing a game with you the whole time. And now they're angry because you're not playing. This was never a game to you. They're angry because you're not playing their game. Furious, jealous, you know, so spirits like you're not coming towards our earth angel in that kind of toxic energy. No, forget it. If you're going to act like the devil, then you need to hang back. You can't come on the same path that, that the divine feminine is on. You stay away from the earth angel. So spirit is protecting you from this person right now. Yeah, they miss their chance. They miss the opportunity. I feel at one point, too, this person, um, they turned their nose up at you. Maybe they treated you like you were nothing, that you weren't enough, that nothing you ever did was ever enough. Okay? They didn't recognize your value. They didn't see your worth until now. And this person has missed out on a holy grail couple love because they... They mistreated you. They played these little games. They kept you in silence. They, there's been no communication, no apology, no explanation, no closure. You had to deal with, um, you know, all the questions. You had to deal with, um, 
it, it felt like uh, unfinished business. Uh, you had to, this person like dropped all the burdens on you, turned their back, and expected you to turn around and chase them. They were dealing with an empress, an earth angel. They're figuring that out now. They're realizing a lot here. This is a spiritual lesson, too, in this cup that spirit is forcing down this person's throat. Okay? It's almost like they're getting kind of a taste of their own medicine here, right? With spirit giving them this, right? Um, it just feels like they're getting a taste of their own medicine. Now you're leaving them behind. Now you don't want to talk to them. You know, yeah, this was a, this was a twin flame soulmate connection, a past life soulmate connection. And now you're being told to move forward, right? Keep going, keep building, be enthusiastic, right? Be enthusiastic with um, the things that are coming into your life. Celebrate your accomplishments here because you've accomplished a lot, okay? And this person, now they're going to be all up in their emotions here, Divine Feminine, missing you, feeling sorry for themselves, right? They're going to start, they're going to start having a pity party. Um, still, the, their vibes are nowhere near yours. You're way ahead of this person. I want to say advanced. They're, they're showing me the word advanced. Yeah, and they're just now starting their lessons. Look at, they've got to carry all these burdens now. You know, I feel like um, now they're feeling exactly the the way that they made you feel. They kind of left you carrying all these burdens. You know, now it's them. They need to carry them. Yeah, and a tower moment too on top of that. So this person is getting karma as well. Not only are they losing you, you're moving on. The door is shut. Okay, you're starting a new cycle in your life, a new phase of your life. It's going to be very free-flowing. It's going to be much easier, I feel, than the last cycle, okay? The worst is, is behind you, you know? And now I feel like you're about to get the best. It feels very luxurious, like spirit is totally putting you on a pedestal here. Okay, and them, they're having their foundation destroyed. Look, you're being raised, you're being exalted to a whole new level. And their foundation is being destroyed. And that's the judgment call of the universe. Okay? The cycle is closing out. You're upgrading... And they're facing a lot of destruction. Let's get some advice for you. And then I'm going to take this over to Patreon. Okay. Um, I want to see what they're going to do next. I, I don't think they can approach you. I feel like spirit is holding them back. Or maybe the divine will let us know what's coming for you in the future. Because I feel like big changes. Like I'm feeling a lot of success. Spotlight. Maybe even, like, this feels like legend kind of energy, fame, okay, a lot of money, new love is coming in as well. So I'm going to look into that. So I feel like um, new love is entering in your life because you're ready for it. I feel like this new person is going to be an emperor. You already have a secret admirer, so there's somebody who's already noticed you who's already watching you from afar, okay? This could also be, um, you know, an ex is going to have to watch you be loved by somebody new. That's, that's part of their karma. Yeah, see, you're moving on. 
you're moving on and you're being spiritually led here by a higher power. I don't know, man. I feel like somebody is about to approach you. There's a new person who's coming in. You have a deep knowing of that as well. Like you can feel it. Some of you are being urged to clear out clutter, right? Um, clean, cleaning out your closet, cleaning out your garage, taking things to donations because spirit is um, guiding you to make room in your life for this new person that's coming in. Okay? You need to make space. So you're going to be, I feel like you're going to be doing a lot of cleaning in the next week. Okay? A lot of cleaning, maybe even having some very vivid dreams of someone new coming in. Okay? Getting prepared. This just feels like spirit is preparing you for what's coming in, okay? And that is a new person. And all of the success, like so many upgrades. Wow, Divine Feminine, congratulations. Congratulations on all of this. And just know, this person from your past, the one who was playing games, now they're, they're gonna have a, their foundation is gonna be leveled. They're gonna get really bad karma and they're going to have to carry the burdens of all of this on their own. Okay. Anyway, um, if you guys are interested in the extended, there is a link to follow in the description box below. That'll take you straight to Patreon. And I'll meet you guys over there. Okay. Um, and uh, yeah, I hope this helps. I hope it resonates. And until next time, Divine Feminine, take care of you and peace out.